I'll have to. I know what I'll do. I'll do it uh, carelessly. And then I'll get out a, a, a brush and a dustpan. <laughs> oh, Lord. When did you... When did you first start working with indeterminacy, working indeterminacy? Well, first I worked with chance operations. And What's then the difference? Chance operations uh, gave the sounds of freedom from my uh, likes and dislikes. But when it was written, for instance, the music of changes, when it was written, it obliged the... Uh, it obliged David Tudor, for instance, the performer, to follow exactly what, what had been written down. And so it occurred to me that the kind of, of freedom that I had through the use of chance operations could be given to him by making the, uh, by my making my work such that it didn't give him a, a specific thing to do, but gave him like a, gave him like a camera with which he could take a photograph. Finally, of course, the listener is presented with something that is, so to speak, determined. By chance. And then are by indeterminacy. You know, this could go on top of that bread. But I'm not sure. I think I'll try it. <laughs> 